Hi, welcome to another refresh video. I'm going to show you the basic processes involved in the refilling of a cartridge with a built-in printhead. Okay, so firstly, we're going to take the lid off and get to the inside of the cartridge just so we can give it a good clean and make sure it's ready for refilling effectively. Okay, so notice the part sponge in there. Uh, we will and we always do replace the sponge with a full one and fill it to its highest capacity, which we'll see later. That done, we'll run through a load of hot water uh, just to flush any ink that's left in there from the sponge and so apply some steam to blast off anything that that didn't take care of. Um, we'll then load it up with some cleaning fluid and place it in our sonic machine, also filled with cleaning fluid, just for a moment or two. As you can see, there was additional ink in the print head and this has now been dislodged and is coming out uh, the bottom of the print head and we'll also find some within the cartridge itself. Okay, so now we've reached the end of the cycle. I'm happy that anything that's going to come out is, is ready to come out of that. So now I'm going to tip any additional ink that's left in there out and dry off the cartridge. Okay, so now we're going to place the cartridge in the spinner. Uh, this will spin around at high speed, pulling anything that's in the cartridge, dirt, water, ink. It'll pull it out and leave us with a nice dry cartridge so that we can respunge it. Lovely, I'm happy with that. Okay, so with the full sponge in, we can now begin to fill the cartridge in our machine. Um, all of the refilling is done under a vacuum, just so it pulls all of the air out of the sponge, fills it with ink, and then when it's filled to its maximum capacity, it will release the vacuum, sucking all of the ink back in and retaining it nicely in the sponge. So as you can see, the cartridge and sponge have now reached the maximum capacity. It's starting to drip out the top a little bit, which is the point where the vacuum will kick in. Suck everything back into the sponge, as I mentioned, leaving us with a nicely refilled cartridge. Okay, so with the cartridge nicely filled, we can begin finishing off the cartridge and getting it ready for sending back to the customer. Okay. So we'll fix a new lid back onto the cartridge. Hold it down for a few seconds just to make sure it's all put nicely set. And then we can proudly rebrand it as a refresh cartridge. Okay, so now we can begin testing the results of our handiwork. Just give it a quick footprint test just to see how the ink's flowing to make sure it's coming out of every point of the head. And then we'll pop it in our tester machine. As you can see, we've got all kinds of slots in our tester machine for all kinds of different cartridges uh, right across the range that we can refill in-house. And then when it's finished testing, we'll get a nice slip, which we can check out. Okay, so here's our test strip. I'm very, very happy with that. It's a nice crisp result uh, and be more than happy to send that back to the customer. Okay, final hurdle crossed. Uh, we can just attach the tape to it now to make sure no ink can leak out of the cartridge. Sit it nicely in the plastic clip so that it won't uh, leak at all in transit. And then heat seal it in a static bag. And we can get that one in the post. Okay, that's everything. I hope that's answered any questions you might have had or uh, dispelled any horrible thoughts in your head about how we refill your cartridges and what we do with them when we have them back. Um, but if you do have any other questions, feel free to drop us an email at inquiries at refreshcartridges.co.uk. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.